This is the Carbo filter. Every week in 2023, an average human can consume a credit card's worth of microplastic from water. Not only that, 100 million precious marine animals die each year from plastic waste alone. There are a lot more marine animals that suffer from this problem. In 2021, the average yearly amount of plastic produced has gone up to 350 million metric tons. Since plastic is a material that's not biodegradable, a consequence of excessive plastic production is that the plastic breaks up into microplastics, but does not fully decompose for more than 600 years. As a result, animals and humans are impacted by the microplastics directly released into the marine environment. Ocean cleanup organizations and governments can only do so much. And with governments and NGOs spending up to 15 billion each year, something else needs to be done. In response, the industrial filter market is rapidly growing, estimated to reach $114 billion in 2030. However, the industrial scaled filter industry lacks innovation and cutting edge technology, making them inefficient and not ideal as a solution to microplastic pollution. This creates a blue ocean scenario for carbo filter to enter, where our innovative technology can provide unmatched efficiency and effectiveness to the industrial filter market. Carbo filter uses carbo nanospring technology, an effective alternative to existing filtration systems with its capability to quickly dissolve microplastic in water. With a brand new technology, we create an all-purpose filtration system that can serve larger consumer groups such as governments and businesses, efficiently creating a blue ocean. Not only does Carbo filter look across ocean cleanup organizations, we move the filter market from consumers to businesses and governments. Technology superiority means that Carbo filter can create complementary household filters powered by the same carbon nanospring seen in larger ones. As a company introducing a brand new alternative to the filter industry, Carbo filter will also shape external trends over extensive periods of time. Below is the three tiers of non-customers. In the current market, we have environmental organizations such as the European Union. Our soon-to-be customers will be global environment protection agencies as the demand for our technology increase. Our second tier will be businesses and factories who will need improved technologies as regulations increase. Our last tier will be third world countries who need filtration technology but is unable to afford them yet. Governments in recent years have become involved in solving microplastic pollution but are unsuccessful because existing industries all have their own inefficiencies. Not only is the industrial filter market and production cost extremely high, but the manual labor required for filter replacements makes it hard to use and unideal. Current industrial filters are also prone to molding and require complex installments. This is where Carbo filter comes in. The Carbo filter is superior in its ability to dissolve microplastics using carbon nanospring technology, which breaks down the microplastics through a mechanism called advanced oxidation processes, a chemical remediation technology involving short-lived chemicals called reactive oxygen species. Several universities' research also shows just how effective carbon nanospring technology could be in wastewater filtration. A study from the University of Adelaide states that carbon nanosprings are chemically stable enough to break microplastics down into compounds that are harmless in a marine ecosystem, proving carbofilter is a feasible and promising innovation. Now, let's break down the carbofilter. First, the water and the microplastic are trapped and the blue valve in the middle will pass the contaminated water to the purple structure. This is where the conductive pipes in the middle will bring the microplastics into the carbon nanospring. After all the microplastics are conducted into the nanospring, reactive oxygen species will be mixed with the microplastics, which will trigger chain reactions that chop the various long microplastic particles into tiny segments that dissolve in water. By eliminating, reducing, raising, and creating the following factors, carbofilter can become a highly efficient product in a blue ocean environment. In the future, carbofilter will be more cost-effective than industrial-scale filters as new and improved technology continues to drive prices down. An average industrial-scale filter lasts for less than 4 months due to extensive usage, while a carbofilter can filter water for more than 10 months effectively in the same usage before seeing declines. With our current development base, we project that we will be able to manufacture 100 carbo filters per month after funding, and each carbo filter will cost $18 more in manufacturing compared to an average industrial scale filter, but yield significantly more effective results. Through selling to governments and large corporates mentioned above, we project to yield an ROI of 310% in 15 months. Our production costs will continue to decrease and our cost efficiency will further increase in the long run as our filters continue to sell. It's time to establish a new blue ocean industry trend with the carbo filter.